We have a section of our track that we have never put any ballast on. And I happened to be out in the back of my building and I noticed that my neighbor had some of those tubes of sand you put in the back of your car for winter for traction. And I noticed one of them had broken open and guess what? There wasn't sand in there. There was really nice fine gravel. And so I looked around because there were several bags there and I saw that in one of the bags it was this really nice gravel that I could use for ballast. And then in another bag, there was some larger stuff that could be used for ballast or would look nice on the railroad. And then in one of the other bags, there was just a mix of dirt and gravel that could probably be used for fill, but definitely not for ballast. So we asked if we could use it. They said yes. And we went ahead and transported it to the railroad and then started scooping it onto the track. We had leveled the track to make sure that it would be level and take a look at the scooper uh, that we are using. It's something my wife handed to me and I said, oh, okay, do you know what it is? Can you see what it is? Yep, that's right. It's a Pringles can, I guess, or a little Pringles container. And the width is just absolutely perfect for scraping the ballast and then using the flat top part of the Pringles can to get it off the track and off to the sides. We put on a lot of ballast because that way when we get snow and rain, some of it will get washed away. One other thing we do to get ready for winter is we clean the track. That way, later when the snow falls, we'll know the track is level with ballast and it's clean and ready to run. 